I've probably got three top tips for networking. First one being to listen. Um, it's not all about going in and searching out the people who can help you specifically and asking questions and asking for things. It's about listening to other people. What, are, what, what can you do to help them, essentially, at the end of the day? Um, who's in your suite of connections in your phone that you can potentially tee them up with to help, you know, to help them get, get the most of their goals um, and what they're after? Um, because in turn, you'll become that go-to person um, and you'll be top of mind for helping them out. So it really is about, you know, give us gain and it is karma. What goes around comes around. So um, number one would definitely be to listen. Uh, number two would be consistency. Um, the one-off networking events, you know, you can go to them and you may pick up a couple of business cards and have a chat, but it really is consistency and building relationships over time. So I would definitely recommend at least a year's worth of the same networking event time and time again. Um, and in doing that in consistency, you then bring into the third one, which would be presence. Um, you'll become more comfortable within that group of people um, with talking you know, and introducing yourself to strangers. So it's, it's, it's building a presence so that people know who you are and know what you're about. Um, and in building that, that presence, people are drawn to those who, you know, own what they do, who love what they do, and it shows through. Um, so they would definitely be my, my top three, to listen, have a presence, and be consistent.